Hoy estamos en Non-Stop People con uno de los fenómenos más grandes en el mundo de la música. Tenemos la suerte de tenerle aquí en España y nos va a regalar unos minutos el gran Shawn Mendes. Shawn, bienvenido. Welcome to Spain. Thank you, thank you. I was How are you? I didn't understand everything you said, but I couldn't understand it. No, no. I, I thought I was better at Spanish before I came. Yo vi en Twitter que tienes un español espectacular. I saw, I saw on your Twitter your amazing Spanish. Well, that's a lot of people helping me too. <laughs> Yeah, really, no, like, like Google Translator. I tweet and it, the tenses are all wrong and everything, but I'm trying, I'm learning. Okay, no, it's great to see you again. Es, es maravilloso verte otra vez aquí en España. Thank you. How are your feelings here? Very good. I really like it here every time. The vibe is really nice and it's nice and warm, so that's nice. Has visto a tus fans en la puerta del hotel? Have you yeah. seen your fans in, in the door of the hotel? Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> yeah, they, I think, the, creo que ellos están eh, esperando desde hace dos noches. They are sleeping. For two, I, two I, heard, here. I heard that a couple of them slept over here last night. Please don't do that. Don't <laughs> sleep outside the hotels. <laughs> Oye, eh, mi pregunta, Carl, después de convertirte en un fenómeno mundial, es si tú ya te has acostumbrado a tanto grito, a tanto chillido, o sea, sacas la cabeza por una ventana, te gritan, te comen. Uh, uh, have you used to this scream and shout? Uh, okay. No. No. No, not at all. Es, o sea, es en plan que tú estás durmiendo y, y de repente escuchas un pitido en tu oído, ¿no? Uh, you are sleeping. And you are remembering Dreaming it? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I don't dream about it, no. I, I wouldn't be able to sleep, it's too loud. I, yo creo que tú eres un, un grandísimo ejemplo para muchísimos jóvenes en todo el mundo. Eso conlleva una gran responsabilidad. I think you are inspiring a lot of young people in the world. And this is, this is a big responsibility for you. Absolutely. Yeah, definitely. I definitely think I, I, that's what I'm trying to do. Y, y hay, algo, hay algo que me gusta mucho de ti, Sean, que es que pareces un chico bueno, o sea, pareces un chico limpio, tienes una imagen muy cuidada, eh, eh, sin grandes excentricidades, ¿no? You look like a healthy boy, a clean boy, yeah. you look like a good boy. Thank you. I, I, I like to think I am. <laughs> is it true? I think it's true, yes. Ok. A good boy. Ahora, bueno chico. Buen chico. Buen chico. Bueno, muy bien. Mira, si tuviéramos público ya habrías arrancado el primer aplauso ahora. Buen chico. Bueno, muchas veces, eh, claro, es que los ejemplos que tienen los, los más jóvenes son, pues eso, ¿no? Eh, parece que hay que eh, romperlo todo, parece que hay que estar en contra siempre de las normas. I think that the big examples that have the, the young people in the music world is like bad, bad boys, ¿no? Yeah, definitely. I think so as well. So we have a good boy and, and a little bad boy. And inside, and inside. the music. Okay. The music is bad. Okay. <laughs> Well, the price of fame, eh, yo quería hablarte un poco de, de, del precio de la fama, quería preguntarte por ello, porque claro, no es normal que en un año haya, tu vida haya cambiado tanto, ¿no? In a year, your, your life has changed a lot. Totally, yeah. A, a ton, it's like completely different from last year. Oh, of course. Yeah. It was amazing. And, and for four years ago. Yeah, when four we years met, ago. Yeah. And <laughs> what, what, yeah, what, what's the price of fame for you? Um, I think like there's a lot of things, like I don't get to see my friends every day at yeah. school. Um, but on, on the other hand, I get to travel the world doing what I love to do and kind of just, you know, create music and that's what I really love to do and not a lot of people are able to do that. So um, the positives definitely weigh out the negatives for sure. Yeah. And um, in any moment, has this world of music te you te has sentido decepcionado a lo mejor? In, in some moments, maybe you've been disappointed uh, of this, wow, amazing world of music, fame. Um, I don't think so. I mean, to be honest, going into it, I knew nothing about it. So everything yeah. is so new, right? Yeah. Entiendo que la familia es muy importante aquí, ¿no? It's, it's, your family is very important in very. this case. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, I think um, that's the most important thing is making sure that you're close with your family. You have a good kind of back behind you. Yeah. Es que muchas veces se nos vende también el éxito como algo tóxico, ¿no? Uh, uh, we, we've seen a lot of artists that maybe um, in this world they are being toxic in this toxic Absolutely. World. I think I mean it's very easy to kind of fall into the the uh, the world of of negative when it comes to being a celebrity. You have like cameras and lights on you and, and eyes on you all day long judging you um, and telling you what why you're not a good person. So I think it's very easy to become toxic and you know and yeah. so but I think it's also just as easy to stay good. I mean, as, like I said, as long as you have the right people and good family and good friends and good people that you work with, for sure. And this, this moment, ¿no? Por ejemplo, este primer momento en el que tú lees la primera crítica en Twitter, this, this first bad tweet, you know, yeah. is like, um, do you remember? What? This first moment when you read your first bad tweet, yeah. you know? Well, criticizing. Yeah, I mean, I think when I, when I first put my videos up on, on Vine and YouTube, 
I, mem I remember reading down the comments and being very kind of heartbroken by like what people were saying. And for, for every 100 good positive tweets, there was one bad one. No, no, I know, I know. But, but the bad one was the one that, that hurt, you know? Yes, And it's, it's so weird that it works like that, but like, I, like the, the nice things being said are always going to be more than the, than the bad, you know? Bueno, por suerte, a ti te quiere todo el mundo. Uh, you have, you're very lucky because every, everyone loves you and you have a very beautiful fandom. Definitely, I think it's, it's uh, incredible to come to places like Spain and Paris and there to be lots, and fa lots of fans here. It's really amazing to see that. Well, in Spain you have, uh, aquí en España, tú tienes unos fans espectaculares que hasta quieren enseñarte a hablar español, que lo sepas. Uh, here in, in Spain you have amazing fans. Yeah. They want you to know how to speak in Spanish. Yeah. And we have here a lot of fans. Oh, it's a Spanish, that's yeah, what that the is. Spanish dictionary but uh, made for your Spanish fans. Okay, so hopefully they're not telling me to say bad words and oh, stuff. If you, if you can, we can, we can prove some words. You know, <laughs> how to be polite, page two. Oh, wow. Food, we'll drink, and animals. Effort into this. I think will be very really useful English. Yeah. these days for you. It's like, oh, this is easy, no? Yeah. Buenas, Buenas noches. Buenas noches, bueno. I know these, I know all these. ¿Cuántos años tienes? How old are you? ¿Cuántos años tienes? Claro. ¿Cómo te Bueno, años, años. Años. Ah. Uh, ¿Cuántos años tienes? Ahora sé, 17. 17. 17 sería. It, huh? 17. 17. This is very different. It's, that's hard. 17. 17. Th is very complicated for. for yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, this is a present from your friend. Thank you. you. So, I'm going to have to use this now when yeah. I go. And talking uh, with your fans. These days, estos días he estado hablando con muchos de tus fans en, en la radio y en la calle cuando, cuando hablo con ellos me los encuentro por ahí. Sabían que hoy vamos a estar juntos. Y ellos me decían, eh, oye, ¿por qué no le preguntas si le gusta Justin Bieber, eh, su compatriota Justin, qué le parece What Do You Mean? I think, yeah, in comparison to Justin and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, Amazing I, translation. Oh, it sounds like mind. English. No, it sounds like English. Um, but... but I think all comparisons when it comes to Justin are great. And I love What Do You Mean. I think it's really cool. The, the direction that he's taking his music in now is very yeah. cool. It's nice to see. Um, I know he was da kind of fell down for a while, but he's kind of coming back strong, and that's really cool to see. Y, y creo que ha hecho un salto hacia una música mainstream super comercial, ¿no? Con What Do You Mean. Eh, ¿Tú ya te la has aprendido? Do you know this, this new song, Justin Bieber? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, is it big here in Spain? It's a big hit. It's, yeah. it's number one. Yeah, I was number one in Spain. Number one in Spain. Everywhere. It's number one everywhere. Yeah. It's a good you know, song. I think you have to collaborate. Yeah, I'd love to. I'd love to. But you know something, you are talking with... with something in Spanish. Something in Spanish? Yeah. I'll, I'll teach him Spanish. With Justin Bieber? Yeah. Oh, will be. You know, it's like the end of the world. <laughs> you know, it's the, <laughs> Spain collapse. <laughs> they collapse. Sí, no, no. Colaboración en español de Justin Bieber y Shawn Mendes y, y explota el mundo. Bueno, eh, y me preguntaban si eh, podrías cantar el estribillo de What Do You Mean? Me han preguntado en la puerta. Para ellas hacer una colaboración luego en su casa. If you can sing What Do You Mean, uh, Curtis, you know? Yeah. If I, what? If you can sing What Do You Mean? Yeah. Justin Bieber song? And they, your fans, will, will make, you know, a track. They'll, like, together. Like, like featuring. I, my fans are genius. They're so smart. Yeah, I know, I know. They can. Because you are a genius and, and you know. <laughs> okay. Genius fans, there you go. Genius fans. <laughs> and would you like to sing this, what do you mean? Yeah, definitely. I think I have to learn it on guitar first, though. Okay, but now, no? No, I, I don't know it well okay, enough. Okay, okay, okay. If I knew it, I don't would. Don't worry. We will make, um, you know, uh, with Photoshop we'll, and yeah, we'll make Photoshop, it we will do something. Ok, talking about your Spanish fans, uh, le dijimos a todos tus fans a través de Nonstop People que enviaran, a través de un hashtag, que por cierto se convirtió en trending topic, eh, que enviaran unos vídeos, eh, unas preguntas en forma de vídeo. Claro, lo normal era enviar pues, un tweet y yo se lo leo, no, esta vez queríamos que él os viera la cara y así ha sido. Entonces hemos seleccionado algunos porque nos han llegado miles. Uh, your Spanish fans have sent us with a hashtag uh, questions, but in video. Because, oh, video questions. Yeah, you can, you can watch directly, you can see their faces. Eh, puedes ver sus caras. Hey, Sean, ¿en tu próximo disco habrá más colaboraciones? Y si es así, ¿con quién tienes pensado hacerlas? Gracias por todo lo que haces por nosotras. And I love you a little too much. <laughs> She wants to know if uh, in your next album will be more collaborations. Yeah, definitely, I think so, for sure. Definitely. Thanks. Bye. 
I'm Claudia. I'm Claudia. Claudia. And Christian is was the most famous person in your contact list. Bye. Bye. My contact list. The most famous person in your contact um, list. Who is famous in your agenda? Uh, I think Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. Yeah. Can we can we call now? Ed Sheeran? <laughs> I don't. We'll think be sleeping. Ed okay, yeah. no He's probably sleeping. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, Max videos. Hi Sean. Uh, if you could act in a Harry Potter movie, in which one would you do it and why? In a what? If you can act in a Harry Potter movie, oh, in which which one? Prisoner of Azkaban. In El Prisionero. El actuaría en El Prisionero. Azkaban. Number three. Yes. Why? It's more. Maybe it's more. That's the most action. Yeah. 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 But the, the last one is amazing. Right? Yeah. They're all amazing. Yeah. I love Harry Potter. The fourth video is Maria, Ainoa, and Lilia. Hi, I'm Maria. Hi, I'm Ainoa. Hi. There's like music I'm here. here. <laughs> We're going to try to speak in English as you try to speak Spanish. Oh, we want to know when was the last time that you did something for the first time. Thanks for coming to Spain. We love you so much. They want to know when was the last time that you did something for the first time. La primera vez que that I did something for the first time. La última vez. Um, that's a hard question. <laughs> the last time I did something for the first time. Um, I think, I don't even know, but when we went, I went to Seattle in America for my birthday and I yeah. went cliff jumping off of a cliff I jumped. No. Yeah, and that was, I think that was my first time. I'd never. Never. Nunca I don't suggest it, it hurt your ears. It hurt your ears. It doesn't feel good in your ears. It's good? No, it hurts. Ah, okay. Bad. Okay. Yeah. No, 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 I had, a, you know, for me, um, Taking a plane is like um, the end of the world. <laughs> no, eh, no me gusta nada coger aviones, claro. But, but your ears pop. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, the last video. She is, uh, 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 we don't have the name now, but she's beautiful. Bonita. Hey, Bonita. as I see you're trying to learn Spanish, so, ¿quién fue tu inspiración para empezar tu carrera en la música? If you didn't understand that, then <laughs> who was your inspiration to start your music career? Thank you. Kisses. I, I love because they, they, they help you. Yeah. You know, they they are helping me when I, like, when I tweet something, if it's wrong, yeah. and they'll correct it for me. Yeah. Um, uh, lots of people, like I looked at, like Bruno Mars, uh, Ed Sheeran, of course, uh, Justin Timberlake, um, all those people. I yeah. didn't understand what you were saying, by the way. <laughs> Le ha preguntado cuál es su máxima inspiración en la música. Y bueno, gente como Bruno Mars is like, wow, do you imagine a collaboration with Bruno Mars? No. Oh, I could never see it. You could be more bigger than Bruno Mars. Maybe one day. You know, you have a big heart. You have a lot of talent. Uh, thank you so much for thank being you. here with me. Thank uh, you. Welcome to Spain again. Appreciate it. Okay. If you remember, next time I'll be fluent. Okay. No, no, no. You, you're great. Okay, I'm okay. You're great. But uh, if you want, Maribel has um, a very good Spanish, uh, you know, classes for the, for these days. All right. Yeah. Only girls are the okay. teachers. Okay. Okay. It's perfect for you. Sounds perfect for me. Muchísimas gracias, Sean. Thank you so much and Thank good you. luck, man. Thank you, guys.